y'all how y'all doing just a little something i'm playing but what i'm playing is my beautiful gold sparkle exotic guitar that hirosan made for me and i love it it's like my number one guitar now the pickups i have in it are the exotic pickups and it's much more of a bluesy sound as opposed to the ice blue guitar that i was given at the very uh, uh beginning of our relationship but these pickups are more bluesier sounding the ice blues are like a little bit more rock because i think those are like dimarzio pickups in it but i'm really liking it and uh, i also have like these titanium bridge saddles right there that uh that uh, kts has put on there for me and hirosan is friends with them the, the maker of the guitars and i like the the sound that it gets it gets this real bright response to it but everything on it is set up just like an old vintage strap you know and uh it's it's just great and then of course i put the old black thing on here because that's kind of like my trademark i don't know something like that. i like my fashion statements so to speak and uh and i guess if you're wondering about this thing uh it's because i like the whammy bar uh, i like it sort of free flowing like that and i don't want it hitting that and doing some sort of percussive sound a lot of times when it hits it so and the biggest frets you can get on here and then of course you got to have the headstock the same color as the body just like the old late 60s fenders uh, but but this exotic guitar is a fine guitar. It's my number one guitar. And of course the Ice Blue is my number one backup. And uh, it, they, just get, they just do a great job. And Exotic also does a great job of taking care of its artists. So I'm sure if you were to get an exotic guitar and you had any problems with it, they'd totally help you out and they'd totally support you and stand by their product. So that's what's great about the company and that's why I stand with Exotic. Three, two, one. <laughs> Hey there, y'all. Well, it's Chris Duarte again, and now I've got my Ice Blue exotic guitar here. I think it's the XJS1 or something like that. I'm so terrible with model numbers, but you can see them. They've got them, the Ice Blue. And it's funny that, that it turned out to be Ice Blue because when Exotic first approached me, uh, they said, what color do you want? And I said, I don't care. Make some sort of greenish color. And they had this. And so it's kind of stuck. And so I'm known for having this. And of course, the headstock is the same color. That's my thing. And the black little toggle switch thing. But this guitar is a much more rock sound on it. And I have the, uh, I have the vintage steel uh, string saddles on here. And they're great. I like the way they respond with this guitar. And uh, it's set up just like a, you know all the measurements and stuff. is just like an old vintage strap. And once again, same, uh, same with the frets, the biggest you can get. And uh, as you can see, I've played this one quite a bit because I had this one for uh, several years, a couple years before the, uh, the gold one came along. And uh, this guitar is great. But since it's more of a rock sound, it's been relegated back to the backup position. But it's still a great guitar. This guitar gets me through a lot of things. You know, whenever I break a string, I switch it over. This guitar just picks up. I never miss a beat. Uh, like I said before, Exotic stands by their products. They stand by me. I mean, they take great care of me, and that's one of the reasons I stick with Exotic. So check out the Exotic guitars. They're gonna, they'll, they'll take care of you, and they'll stand by their products, and, uh, and so I can get to playing. <laughs> 